Hey everybody, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrances. Hope you're having a great day. What's your seven day or seven night? Leave a comment down below. So, Louis Vuitton has another banger coming out, right? Well, we hope it's a banger fragrance. <laughs> we don't know yet, but we'll see very shortly. A new release coming out. I saw a post in the group and I just want to give my thoughts before it comes out on it. If you guys like this type of content, please share support by clicking that red subscribe button down below. If you're new or have been watching for a while and haven't subscribed, I would appreciate that. This fragrance is from the house of Louis Vuitton and is no other than Pacific Chill. So I'll post a picture of the bottle on the screen here. Um, and then in a few minutes, I'll post the actual notes. So this fragrance is coming out May 18th. So you say, how, how do you know about that, Chris? I'm my sales associate, Louis Vuitton, shot me a quick email trying to figure it out. Like, hey, do you have any dates yet? So they had a date, so it says May 18th. It's subject to change. It might come out the 19th, the 20th, or might come out the 1st of June. I'm not really sure, but right now it says the 18th for the USA. You can buy that selective Louis Vuitton boutiques. Not everyone may have it on the 18th, but it will be available on the 18th on the website to order it or buy it, purchase it, whatever you call it. So the note breakdown we have is, bear with me, I'm gonna post on the screen. You have lemon, peppermint, cedar, coriander, ambret seeds, basil, Carrot seeds, May rose, black currant, apricot, date, and fig. There's a lot of notes here. So now, before I start how I think it's going to smell, the price point, they don't give a price yet. But I think it's going to be the same price as all the other Louis Vuitton fragrances. Because I have three other Louis Vuitton fragrances. I have City of Stars, which just came out, what, last year? I do have a year before, a couple years before that, Afternoon Swim, Jerome's favorite fragrance, and Louisiana Fragrance. And I do have my new release I just bought, Cellar Room. So I have three Louis fragrances, right? Crazy Louis money. <laughs> I guess I'm a Louis fanboy now, right? <laughs> Still love my Dior baby, but nevertheless, these fragrances are banging. I have a full review of Cellar Room coming up very soon on my channel. Pacific Chill. So like I said before, it's about $300 probably for a 100 ml bottle. And if you want the big 200 ml, you're looking at about $430. This might go up or down depending on if this is a special limit edition or it's going to be regular marketing as a price for all the Louis Vuitton fragrances, I don't know. I'm just estimating. I'm excited for this one, guys. So why I'm excited because it has notes of lemon. It has peppermint, cedar. These are notes that I like in fragrances. I'm thinking hopefully this will have an opening of lemon, mint, coriander, and maybe some uh, black currant. That'll be kind of nice if the opening is like that. These are the notes listed, but they don't have it in order like top mid slash hard or dry down you know what i mean or base notes it doesn't have nothing like that going off fingers crossed of my own um idea of what it would actually the notes would would list it in a note breakdown but the mid i'm thinking it's going to be maybe more ambre and some basil and carrot seed that carrot seed note i smelled a couple fragrances it kind of didn't really work too well for me but fingers crossed i hope it's better in this fragrance here apricot it's kind of a nice touch of the fragrance. I smelled a few fragrances of apricot and it came out very smelling amazing. There is some date and there's some fig. The fig kind of gives me that feel like it's going to be a great Oshi, Oshi, Oceani type of fragrance. Ocean, uh, green, um, herbal, fresh, uh, slightly lemony, minty fragrance, which sounds amazing. Oh, the coriander is what I'm a little afraid about because some coriander fragrances I wear come off kind of light, not heavy like, and they seem to don't last more than like five-ish hours on my skin, so I'm kind of worried about that. Now, the cedar wood sounds amazing because a lot of cedar wood-based fragrances tend to last longer and longer on my skin in that seven, eight, nine hours. So this looks like more of a fresh fragrance. You've seen the green bottle, you've seen the black cap. So I feel like this will be your spring and summer type of fragrance. So fingers crossed, I hope this is gonna be your spring and summer banger with these type of notes. Now, please keep in mind, all these notes might get axed. You only keep maybe a few for the actual fragrance when it comes out, or they may not list all these notes on the Louis Vuitton website. But these are notes that they say that are listed, but when it actually comes out, they might take some of these notes out just for marketing purposes. They might only keep mint, lemon, coriander, and cedar. They may not keep the ambre, the uh, carrot seed, so on and so forth. But I'm thinking this is gonna be a very green fresh fragrance i'm wearing green right to represent it and i'm excited guys i'm hoping it's somewhere in that range of maybe a better than your cactus garden that got axed or discontinued so the sung song i love sung song i should have bought sung song over afternoon swim which is funny because that was my favorite 
but Kelly didn't like because it kind of smells sour on my skin. That would be my first Louis Vuitton purchase ever, Song Song. And I regret looking back at it now. I should have bought Song Song and then bought Afternoon Swim. Nevertheless, that's for another video and another story day. <laughs> but are you guys excited for this new release? I'm super excited, guys. I'm going to go on a whim. I'm going to go on a whim or um, to think it's going to be a banger fragrance. I'm going to give it uh, a 9 out of 10 before I smell it. I'm thinking it's going to be a banger. And most of the time, fragrances are hits. Now, performance, I don't know. Maybe we'll get six hours. Maybe we'll get eight. I'm praying for eight hours, right, for a freshie. But we all know it's usually about five or six hours. Um, If you guys are excited for this fragrance, let me know in the comment section below. I'm definitely excited. If the peppermint is potent, I'm going to suck for peppermint. I'm going to buy a peppermint fragrance again, guys. <laughs> But hey, man, this is just a quick follow-up, what I feel about it. When it comes out on May 18th, I will have a first impression, or within the couple days it's released, you will have a first impression on my channel. I'll do the best I can to do that for you guys, or I'll buy the bottle. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoy this type of content, please show your support by clicking that red subscribe button down below. Like the video and click the bell icon so you don't miss any future fragrance upload alerts on my channel or giveaways as well. I'll see you next video very soon. Peace.